11 Smart Ways to Deal with Toxic People On a sunny morning, I stumbled upon an old photograph of myself lost between the pages of a forgotten book. The smile frozen in time led me to ponder who was I at that exact moment and who am I now? As Socrates said, know thyself. But how many of us truly embark on this deep journey? Surprisingly, 80% of people believe they know themselves well, yet only a fraction truly into the depths of their being. I challenge you to look inward. Beyond the layers of expectations and social masks, what will you discover about yourself today? Let's explore this in the video, so make sure you subscribe to continue on this journey with us. Self-awareness. Have you ever pondered why, despite being the protagonist on life stage, we sometimes find ourselves lost amidst the daily antagonists? Today, let's delve into the enigma of self-awareness, the compass guiding us through this journey. Understanding oneself is akin to possessing a map in an uncharted land. It's about unraveling the depths of our being, discovering not only our strengths, but also our vulnerabilities. In doing so, we transform obstacles into stepping stones for growth. Imagine having the clarity to discern that a negative comment reflects more about the speaker than it does about you. Self-awareness is not about isolation. It's about forging stronger connections with others. By diving deep within, we emerge equipped with a shield capable of deflecting negativity. Through continuous introspection, we make self-awareness a ritual, a habit as essential as drinking water or breathing. Each challenging situation becomes an opportunity to ask, what does this teach me about myself? It's about disarming toxicity, making wiser decisions, and ultimately achieving inner peace. And as we navigate this path, every step we take illuminates the way for others to find theirs. It's a journey of forgiveness and memory, where resilience blooms from adversity and healthy relationships flourish amidst the storms. So let's embark on this journey of self-awareness together, lighting the path not just for ourselves, but for those around us too. Forgiveness and memory. In our journey through life, we encounter pivotal moments that define not only who we are, but also who we will become. These moments, often shrouded in difficulty and pain, serve as catalysts for growth and transformation. Yet, amidst the challenges, there lies the profound art of forgiveness and memory. Forgiveness isn't merely about letting go, it's a profound act of liberation, freeing ourselves from the shackles of resentment and bitterness. It's like sculpting beauty from the rough blocks of our experiences, carving out resilience from the stone of adversity. And while forgiveness softens the edges of our past, memory acts as our guide, illuminating the path forward while safeguarding against repeating past mistakes. It's about redefining our relationship with the past, not to erase it, but to learn from it, to glean wisdom from the scars of our journey. Each memory becomes a sentinel, standing guard over our growth, reminding us of the storms we've weathered and the strength we've gained. So, as we navigate the twists and turns of life, let us embrace the power of forgiveness and memory, forging ahead with grace and resilience knowing that every step forward is guided by the wisdom of our past. Emotional stability. Emotional stability is the anchor that steadies us amidst life's storms and negative circumstances. It's about harnessing the power of emotional intelligence to navigate towards our goals with clarity and purpose. Picture yourself as a ship sailing through tumultuous seas. Emotional stability is your compass, guiding you towards calmer waters. By honing our emotional intelligence, we learn to recognize and manage our emotions effectively, preventing them from capsizing our ship. It's about staying centered amidst chaos, maintaining a sense of inner peace even when the world around us seems turbulent. Emotional stability empowers us to respond to challenges with resilience rather than react with impulsivity. It's like building a fortress around our emotions, protecting ourselves from the onslaught of negativity. 
And as we cultivate emotional stability, we discover that it's not about suppressing emotions, but about understanding and channeling them constructively. It's about fostering a sense of equilibrium that allows us to weather any storm without losing sight of our destination. So let us embrace the power of emotional stability, using it as our North Star to guide us through life's ever-changing tides. Setting boundaries. Setting boundaries is the cornerstone of maintaining healthy relationships and achieving personal satisfaction. It's about drawing a line in the sand, establishing limits that safeguard our emotional well-being and preserve our sense of self. Imagine yourself as the architect of your own fortress, crafting walls that protect your inner sanctuary from intruders. Boundaries serve as our personal guardians, guiding us towards interactions that nurture rather than deplete us. They empower us to say yes to what aligns with our values and no to what compromises our integrity. Setting boundaries isn't about building walls to keep people out. It's about creating gates that invite in those who respect and honor our boundaries. It's about asserting our needs and desires with confidence, knowing that doing so is essential for our mental and emotional health. Boundaries provide us with the freedom to prioritize self-care without guilt or shame. They allow us to invest our time and energy in relationships that are reciprocal and uplifting. And as we uphold our boundaries, we pave the way for deeper connections built on mutual respect and understanding. So let us embrace the power of boundaries, recognizing them as essential tools for cultivating fulfilling relationships and fostering personal growth. Energy management. Managing your energy intelligently is the key to unlocking a life of vitality and positivity, both for yourself and those around you. Think of it as recharging your inner battery to radiate light and warmth in every interaction. Just as you plug in your phone to charge, taking intentional steps to replenish your energy reserves can enhance your well-being and amplify your impact on the world. Consider meditation, not just as a moment of peace, but as a powerful tool for recalibrating your mind and body. Each session is like plugging into a source of inner peace and clarity allowing you to navigate life's challenges with grace and resilience. And let's not forget about nutrition. Feeding your body with nourishing foods is like fueling a fire, igniting your energy and vitality from within. But managing your energy isn't just about individual practices, it's also about understanding how your energy influences those around you. Like a ripple effect, your positive energy can inspire and uplift those in your orbit creating a ripple effect of positivity. By cultivating mindfulness and intentionally managing stress, you become a beacon of light in a sometimes dim world, guiding others towards greater peace and fulfillment. So let's embark on this journey of energy management together, embracing practices that nourish our minds, bodies, and spirits, and empowering ourselves to positively influence the world around us. Focusing on your goals. Focusing on your goals isn't just about having a destination in mind. It's about cultivating the unwavering determination to stay the course, even when faced with challenges or distractions. Imagine yourself as an archer, eyes fixed on the target, bow drawn, taut with purpose. Each arrow you release is a step towards your dreams, propelled by the strength of your focus and the clarity of your vision. But staying focused isn't always easy. It requires discipline, resilience, and a steadfast belief in yourself and your abilities. It's about tuning out the noise of doubt and negativity and tuning into the quiet voice within that whispers, you can do this. Just as a lighthouse guides ships safely to shore amid stormy seas, your goals serve as beacons of light, illuminating the path forward through life's ever-changing currents. And when the winds of adversity threaten to blow you off course, it's your focus that keeps you anchored, rooted in the belief that every setback is merely a stepping stone on the journey to success. So let your goals be your North Star, guiding you towards a life of fulfillment and personal satisfaction. Embrace the power of focus and watch as your dreams transform from distant aspirations into tangible realities, one arrow at a time, responding to challenges, Responding to challenges isn't just about weathering the storm. 
It's about harnessing the wisdom and inner strength within you to navigate through the tempest and emerge stronger on the other side. Picture yourself as a skilled captain, steering your ship through treacherous waters with a steady hand and a resolute spirit. Each obstacle you encounter becomes an opportunity to tap into your resilience and resourcefulness, transforming adversity into triumph. But facing challenges head-on requires more than just brute force. It requires a strategic approach guided by wisdom and self-awareness. It's about recognizing when to hold firm and when to adapt, when to push forward and when to pause and regroup. Like a master chess player, you anticipate your opponent's moves and plan your strategy accordingly, always staying one step ahead. And as you navigate through the twists and turns of life, remember that every challenge is a test of your character and a chance to grow. Embrace the journey, knowing that each obstacle you overcome strengthens your resolve and deepens your resilience. So when faced with adversity, stand tall and face it head on, drawing upon the wellspring of wisdom and inner strength that lies within you. For it is through facing challenges that we discover our true power and potential and emerge victorious in the game of life, avoiding unnecessary conflicts. Avoiding unnecessary conflicts is like preserving the tranquil waters of your inner peace while fostering harmonious relationships through the art of conflict avoidance. It's about choosing the path of serenity over the tumult of needless confrontation, maintaining a sense of calm amidst life's inevitable storms. Imagine yourself as a skilled diplomat, adept at navigating the delicate balance between asserting your needs and diffusing potential conflicts with grace and diplomacy. Each interaction becomes an opportunity to practice the art of conflict resolution, finding common ground and fostering understanding rather than fueling discord. But steering clear of unnecessary conflicts isn't just about avoiding confrontation. It's about cultivating empathy and understanding, recognizing that everyone has their own struggles and perspectives. It's about choosing compassion over conflict, seeking to build bridges rather than erecting walls. And as you navigate the intricate web of human relationships, remember that true strength lies not in the ability to dominate others, but in the capacity to foster peace and understanding. So let us embrace the power of conflict avoidance, choosing dialogue over discord and harmony over hostility. By cultivating a spirit of cooperation and empathy, we can create a world where conflicts are resolved peacefully and relationships flourish in the fertile soil of mutual respect and understanding. Detecting false friendliness. Unveiling false friendliness is akin to deciphering a hidden code within the vast realm of human interactions, a skill essential for preserving genuine and meaningful relationships. It's about developing a keen eye for distinguishing authentic warmth from superficial charm, ensuring that the connections we cultivate are built on sincerity and integrity. Imagine yourself as a skilled detective, equipped with intuition and insight, unraveling the subtle clues that betray the true nature of a person's intentions. Each interaction becomes an opportunity to hone your discernment to separate genuine affection from mere pretense. But uncovering false friendliness isn't just about protecting yourself from manipulation. It's about fostering a culture of authenticity and trust in your relationships. It's about creating space for genuine connections to flourish, rooted in mutual respect and understanding. And as you navigate the intricate dance of human interaction, remember that true friendship is a precious gift one that is earned through sincerity, loyalty, and shared experiences. So let us embrace the challenge of discerning true friendship from false, cultivating relationships that enrich our lives and nourish our souls. By cultivating a spirit of authenticity and discernment, we can build a world where genuine connections thrive and true friendship is treasured above all else. Proper self-analysis. Mastering healthy self-analysis is akin to transforming negative self-criticism into a positive driving force to enhance self-image, a skill crucial for personal growth and self-empowerment. It's about harnessing the power of introspection to uncover hidden strengths 
within the depths of self-doubt, turning perceived flaws into opportunities for self-improvement. Imagine yourself as a skilled alchemist, adept at transmuting the lead of self-critique into the gold of self-actualization. Each moment of self-reflection becomes a crucible for transformation, where the fires of self-awareness forge resilience and fortitude. But cultivating healthy self-analysis isn't just about silencing the inner critic. It's about embracing it as a catalyst for growth and self-discovery. It's about viewing setbacks and shortcomings not as obstacles, but as stepping stones on the path to personal excellence. And as you navigate the intricate landscape of self-discovery, remember that true self-empowerment lies in embracing your imperfections and leveraging them as fuel for progress. So let us embark on the journey of self-analysis with courage and conviction, knowing that each moment of introspection brings us one step closer to realizing our full potential. By cultivating a spirit of self-compassion and resilience, we can unlock the door to a brighter, more empowered future, where self-doubt is transformed into self-assurance and self-critique becomes a catalyst for growth. Solution-Oriented Approach Embracing a solution-focused approach is akin to becoming a proactive seeker of practical solutions amidst life's challenges, rather than dwelling on obstacles and problems. It's about adopting a mindset of optimism and resilience, where every setback is viewed as an opportunity for growth and innovation. Picture yourself as an intrepid explorer, forging ahead with unwavering determination in search of the next breakthrough. Each problem becomes a puzzle to solve, a chance to unleash your creativity and resourcefulness. But adopting a solution-focused mindset isn't just about problem solving, it's about cultivating a culture of positivity and possibility in every aspect of your life. It's about reframing setbacks as opportunities, and setbacks as stepping stones on the path to success. And as you navigate the twists and turns of life's journey, remember that true resilience lies not in avoiding obstacles, but in overcoming them with courage and determination. So let us embrace the solution-focused approach with enthusiasm and vigor, knowing that every challenge is an opportunity in disguise. By cultivating a spirit of innovation and perseverance, we can turn setbacks into springboards for success and obstacles into opportunities for growth.